Hey, it's your girl, Happy Teach. And a question came in about how to use Adobe Stock, more so how to get rid of the watermark for Adobe Stock. Well, this video is made for my students, so that's the mode that I'm going to be teaching in. Um, with Adobe Stock, you do not have to use Adobe Stock to create your videos, for one. However, Adobe Stock is amazing, and it is awesome. Um, but you do have to use a professional um, photo um, stock site uh, with the photos that you use. And that's just because they're going to have the quality that you need uh, to make sure there's no pixelation, to make sure that it meets the proper resolution and things like that for the products that we're going to uh, create. <clears throat> Sorry. Sorry about that. All right. So I'm at stock.adobe.com and you're at images. Okay. So Adobe Stock has a lot of images that are here for you to use free, but you have to know how to filter it. So right here where you see images, all you have to do is click on this drop down, and all the way toward the bottom, you're going to see free. It's right above premium. Click on free. So now if your topic was something like, um, let's see something I don't use. I always use these. But let's say if your topic was something like football, um, because it's coming up. I would click that, make sure it says free, and it's only going to show you the um, images that are free. So for instance, if we really like this one, or if we really like this one with them um, coming out, or maybe we really like this one, whichever photo you really like, all you have to do is you're going to see this license. Now, remember, as long as it's from the free ones, you can license it, no issue. See, it's going to say free right here. So I'm going to click on license. And what happens is, is this licensing is going to show up in your Adobe library over here, and it's going to show down here in your downloads. So that is where the image is going to be. So you can use Adobe Stock. Every image um, isn't for, um, you know, for, for a price. A lot of them, like I said, there are a whole bunch that are free. So that is how you would use it. And then I could go down here. I'm on Chrome. So however yours brings, but it's, regardless, it's going to be your downloads folder. So I'm going to click here and I'm going to choose show in Finder because I'm also on a Mac. So that's what it's going to show for me. Yours, I think, shows in something different. But um, you would just click that. And then for me, uh, let me... Minimize this a little bit. So for me, my downloads folder is going to open and I can click to look and that image is right here in my downloads folder. So that pretty much is how you bring a photo in from Adobe Stock that is free. You grab it from your downloads folder. You can put it wherever you want and you use it from there. So hopefully this video helps you out. That was the goal of the video. If it does, please like, share, subscribe. All right, until next video, ta-ta for now. Ta-ta, ta-ta.